How about I just tried carving my pumpkin? I was gonna do this like really pretty like cat detail, and the cat's head snapped off. So now I have to go buy another pumpkin, and I'm really sad. Anyway, hi guys, it's me Allie, and today, since Halloween is slowly not slowly approaching, it's like next Wednesday, so kind of fast. Um, since it's approaching, I figured I'd do something Halloween-y, and since I haven't done tutorials like every other makeup person here on YouTube, I thought I would do the spooktacular tag. Ooh. Um, I saw Beauty Baby 44 do it, and I'm not sure if she made it up, or if I just haven't seen anyone else who's done it lately, but I'm going off her questions, so... If Lindsay made it up, like, props to you, girl, because this is an awesome tag. So, I'm very excited, and let's just go right in. It's a, uh, first question is, do you still trick-or-treat? And I would still love to trick-or-treat, because I don't think you have to be a certain age to get free candy. Like, free candy, come on, who doesn't want that? But all of my friends are losers, and they're all like, Allie, we're 17 years old, we shouldn't be trick-or-treating, like, we're too old for that. And I'm like, but... Guys, free candy. What? I'm like, why? Why? What? They're like, that's embarrassing. They all think it's embarrassing. I don't. So, personally, I would still like to trick or treat, but since I don't want to go by myself, no, I do not trick or treat. Number two, do you like going to haunted attractions? Um, I don't. I hate, hate, hate scary things with a passion. There's, there's a little theme park, like kind of near my, like where I live. And there's a haunted house there, and it's like meant for little kids to go in, and I won't even go in that. I refuse. I hate haunted houses, haunted hayrides, anything like that. I hate being scared, and because I'm, it's I'm so easily scared that it's like awful. Um, number three, what is your favorite Halloween candy? Probably either the Reese's little pumpkin things or Twix love Twix. Or Butterfingers. I like Butterfingers. I only like the mini Butterfingers though because I feel if I have like a big one there's so much of it that like I can't eat it all. So the mini ones. Favorite Halloween movie. Okay. Now favorite Halloween movie was the Halloween Town series. Especially the first two. Um, they're like those are like the Disney Channel Halloween movies that like I grew up watching as a little kid. And I still love those pieces. But until maybe like last week, I'd never seen the movie Hocus Pocus. And I know all of you are probably like, oh, like, what? How did you live? And honestly, I have no idea. Because when I saw that, I was like, where has this movie been all my life? I'm in love with that movie. So right now, my favorite Halloween movie is Hocus Pocus. Because since I watched it like four days ago, I've seen it at least three times. Like, I love it. I love it. And I'm so happy that... My friends convinced me to watch it. I'm, so, Halloween Town, Hocus Pocus. Number five, favorite scary movie. Um, like I said before, I really don't like getting scared, so often I do not watch scary movies. Like, I've never seen Paranormal Activity, any of them. Um, my friends made me sit through Saw, and that was the worst. Oh my gosh, I almost peed my pants. When I was in about seventh grade, I saw It. That was bad. I like all of the, like, I know what you did that summer movies, but, like, they're, like, corny, scary, so it doesn't, I don't know if that counts. Um, ooh, I really like, I really, I like the movie Disturbia. That's a good movie, but, like, it's more suspenseful than scary, but, like, it's still kind of freaky. So, I like Disturbia, so probably favorite scary movie would be Disturbia. But, yeah, other than that, like, I really won't watch any of them. Number six, favorite costume you ever wore as a child? When I was little, I I remember being a lot of things. I was a cheerleader a lot because I already was a cheerleader, so like I didn't need to buy a costume. I was a cheerleader. I was probably a pumpkin because I think like that's like everyone as an infant is always like a little pumpkin. Uh, I remember. Oh, one of the favorite ones I remember. I was a little princess. I'm a little tiara. And I really like that, and I'll insert a picture of that if I can find it right here. Number seven, first costume you can remember wearing. Once again, pumpkin. I think all newborns, like, it's tradition that, like, 
Hi, all newborns, let's dress you up as a tiny little pumpkin. Because, like, it's cute, so, pumpkin. Number eight, favorite fall food and beverage. Ooh, this is a good one. Um, favorite fall food? Probably pumpkin pie. Or... I just made pumpkin cupcakes the other day. It was probably, basically anything with pumpkin. I made pumpkin cupcakes the other day that were really good. I like pumpkin pie. I like... I'm trying to think of what else. There's really no specific food that like I get in the fall that really doesn't involve pumpkin. So, basically any pumpkin food. Uh, oh, beverage too. Um, apple cider I love. When Dunkin' Donuts gets its pumpkin like flavoring, I always, oh my gosh, pumpkin iced coffee. So good. I don't even care if it's like 50 degrees outside. I will still drink an iced coffee. I don't like hot coffee that much. Iced coffee is where it's at. Um, I also like Dunkin' Donuts white hot chocolate. That's really good too. Number nine, do you have a festive background on your phone? But well, let's look at my phone now, shall we? No, I don't. The background on my phone is the bouquet that I had for my sister's wedding. Here, I'll show you guys. Yeah, so they're pretty little flowers. Yeah. What are you going to dress up as this year? Um, like I said, I won't be going to retreating this year probably because my friends are losers. But I work where I go to church, like in my youth group. We have, we've put on a Halloween party for little kids. Um, every single year and we all have to dress up so this year and that was actually today this year I was a vampire I had like these little fangs that like I stuck on and I curled my hair for it and I just wore like a black dress and like black tights and black shoes and black sweater so yeah I was a vampire uh, number 11 what will your pet be my I have two little small dogs for those who don't know and a little cat well not a little cat she's kind of fat but whatever she's like a kitty uh, still um, they do not like dressing up because they don't like wearing clothes. It's really unfortunate because I always go to, like, Target and they have such cute pet costumes. I saw one the other day and it was, like, it was, like, wide receiver. It was, like, a little football guy. I was like, oh, that'd be cute for, like, a golden retriever. But I don't have a golden retriever, but I don't know. They had, like, cute little, like, witches and, like, pirates. They were all so cute. I really wish my... Number 12, what candy do you have left in your stash after you eat everything else? There's always a lot of things I always have. I always have, um, like saltwater taffy. Like, where I live, like, everyone gives that out. And I'm like, really? I'm like, what? No. Um, dots. I don't like dots. I, I really don't. Um, Mr. Good Bars. I always have a lot of, I'm not really a fan of those. Uh, I mean, like, I, like, there's a lot of, like, black licorice. I'm not a fan of that. Uh, trying to think of what else. Um, I kind of eat everything. If I don't eat everything, then I give it to my mom, and she'll eat a bunch of stuff. So, really, there's not a lot that goes to waste in my family. And if my mom doesn't eat it, my dad eats it. If my dad doesn't eat it, my brother eats it. And then if I, no one else eats it, then we throw it away. Teen, do you decorate your house? Yes, I do. Um, just sitting right here, we have a Happy Halloween sign there, a little jack-o'-lantern, a little witch that like has terrified me since I've been like four years old. Over there we have little like scarecrows and the pumpkin, and we have, oh, here I'll show you him. He's my favorite. I've had this little guy, this little guy, ever since I was like, maybe like six, seven years old. Look at him. He's so cute. He presses his hand. <laughs> As I'm laughing. Hang on. Happy Halloween! I love this thing. It's so cute. And it like vibrates like when it's like laughing. And the laugh is really creepy so like no one else likes it. But I love this little guy. Pumpkin patches, corn mazes, or hay rides. Um, I've never been through a corn maze, I don't think, unless I was really little. Pumpkin patch or hayride? 
At my pumpkin patch, they give hay rides. Like, you have to go on a hay ride to get to the pumpkin patch. So really, I can't decide. Pumpkin patch and hay rides. Because I love them both. I love them. So I love the smell of hay, and I love picking out a pumpkin. So both. I cheat. Whatever. Fifteen. Going to a core maze, what do you wear? Three jeans. A flannel. If it's cold, then like a flannel and like a sweater over the flannel. Or like the flannel as like a shirt and like underneath. Or like a flannel as a sweater and then underneath the flannel and like a long sleeve shirt. And then probably my black like motorcycle boots. Because I wouldn't want to wear like my fake Uggs because then they would get ruined. So probably those ones. Yeah. Maybe beanie if it's cold. Keep my little head warm. Alright guys, so that is the end of the spooktacular tag. Are all you spooked? Are you like, ooh, spooky? Probably not, because none of that was scary. Unless you're like terrified of looking at my face. And for that reason, I am so sorry. <laughs> um, make sure you guys comment and tell me any other videos you want me to see. Or you want me to see. I mean, leave requests down below if you want me to watch any certain video. Totally. But also leave requests of what you want to see. Uh, make sure to subscribe and follow me on Twitter and Facebook and Instagram and all that fun stuff. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye! I really hope my makeup looks okay right now. Because I am literally being blinded by light. And it's like the camera's so far away that I can't tell. So if I don't look good, then... Sorry. <laughs> I have no idea.